So Namco founder Nakamura dies at 91. And what I wanted to do with this video is just go through some of his achievements and read over this article and just uh, go ahead and let you know the information of how Nakamura has affected gaming as a whole since, uh, well, in the 80s. So let's begin. Apparently, Nakamura's death was released this week. He founded Namco in 1955 under the original name of Nakamura Manufacturing when the company was constructing children's rides for department stores. Then later, the company's name was renamed Nakamura Amusement Machine Manufacturing Company for obvious reasons. And then they moved to arcade games as the rise of those became super popular. He was responsible for developing and publishing and influencing titles like Pac-Man, Dig Dug, Xevious, Pole Position, and the company also acquired Japan's oldest film studio in 1993. He remained with the company as an honorary uh, board member, like an honorary position, when it merged with Bandai and became Namco Bandai, and the uh, company would later be renamed uh, Bandai Namco. He was awarded the Order of the Rising Sun by the Japanese government in 2007 for his contributions to the industry, which is a massive, massive honor to be given something by your own government for your achievements as a single person is amazing. Nintendo of America released a statement on its Twitter saying, as a partner, Namco has been a big part of Nintendo history thanks in large part due to Nakamura. He changed gaming for the better. This guy was the uh, founder and creator of the company. It is very sad to see him go. Someone so influential in the video games uh, industry and uh, being dead at 91 years old I mean he was only nine years away of being a hundred and that is basically what everyone would uh, say the human life expectancy span is to last when you're a perfectly healthy person so I'd say he probably lived a very fulfilling life and kudos to him my hats off to him I don't think the video game industry would be the same without Pac-Man as Pac-Man is one of the most recognizable and iconic characters in video gaming history. So, rest in peace, Nakamura. Hopefully, we will have new gaming icons arise to uh, take his place and help guide the future as Nakamura did. Ladies and gentlemen, you guys have yourselves a great day. As always, I've been your host, Pretamari, and I'm signing out. Please leave a comment how this individual may have affected your life. Maybe you played Pac-Man as a kid. Maybe you really loved Dig Dug. Maybe you were into Atari or the NES as a kid, or maybe you love playing Pac-Man on uh, Smash Brothers. Just let me know your thoughts and opinions down in the comments section below. And as always, good gaming and God bless. Thanks for watching.